Star I agree, Stadium. Man, you're definitely not going on a flat stage. And I'm guessing that Matt Beach banned all the other like wonky platform stages, so. Got PS2. Yeah, I could get to. Uh... The closer the the better the platforms are set up, the better Ike gets. Uh, Smashville is normally seen as Ike's uh, one of, or if, if not his best stage. Uh, Battlefield also, but PS2 perfectly fine. Give him a lot of space. Ike's airspeed is not to be slept on, so it's a uh, it's gonna be a bit of a task on how wide this stage can be for Ike's to keep up on the ground. Yeah, and yeah, right now Matt Beach already won't already walling AIV out and um, like we said AIV needs a double three stock so he needs to keep this low honestly if he expects to do a three stock he needs to take this first stock about like right now he needs to do something right now and he needs to like hold that second stock above un like under 130 I mean Matt Beach knows his win condition like he's playing like he has a lead not only in game but out of game like this is this is the gameplay that he can play at because whether you risk yourself or not like all he needs is one stock so might as well just chip away and take your time because you don't need anything else yeah 102 to 79 though AIV starting to put some put some damage on the board and this is where it gets scary particularly against a heavy hitter like Ike uh, while Mega Man has great zoning capabilities some of his kills come from uh, particular confirms, uh, particularly with Metal Blade, and I can just kind of swing eventually. And if he, whether he's landing there or forward air or back air, they eventually all lead to the same place. Yeah, and almost taking that stock is Matt Beach, and you know it's not looking too good for AIV right now. At 146. And, yeah, Matt Beach is just on the other side of the stage, <laughs> throwing throwing projectiles. Yeah, and that's it, man. And caught him with the classic roll behind grab. And I mean, these players are going to play it out, but suddenly a weight is lifted off the shoulders of uh, DePaul as they will be going. Uh, they will be going into the finals tomorrow, though, just by how much it remains to be seen. And we definitely want to still see a really good game for the rest for the remainder of, uh, of our time. Yeah. And, um, yeah, you know, and Matt Beach, you know, still, same strategy. Playing hit and run against Ike, and uh, Ike is a character. Man. Yeah, he almost floated off the top. You you like, you don't want to interact with Ike right now. And um, and that's, Mega Man is probably the best character not interacting with you. <laughs> top three character not interacting is Mega Man, so. Good stuff on Matt Beach. Hey, he's, he's playing jump and shoot, man. That's what he's doing. <laughs> <laughs> he's, he's running. He's jumping, and he's shooting. Jump. <laughs> he's got all of his tools. <laughs> yeah, and this AIV is just trying to find a way in. Um, trying. He's actually trying to throw out a bunch of forward airs to try to air-to-air -air Mega Man. And um, not quite getting there. Matt Beach spacing pretty well. God, the, the short hops, too. Okay, that... <laughs> the up tilt was a little bit greedy, but I mean at this position you could probably afford to get a little bit greedy You're... Yeah, 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 it's 150 you're kind of just dead Yeah, yeah the, the demoralizing thing about that is just like, you know, because you're not supposed to jump out of that If you jump out of that in, the, in that animation, like anything past 20% you're gonna fly off the top, right? So, think about that, it's so demoralizing because you, we know the percents, right, of dying off the top, but there's no spark animation. There's nothing. There's no effect. You just, you just die. <laughs> That's so Blood true. Away. I never even thought of that. What <laughs> away? No noise. Anything? Just buy. Just buy. All right. That's that's kind of a shame. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, but, you know, I wonder if this has kind of, well, the game is, well, the set is lost at this point. The game certainly isn't, and I wonder if that's lifted a little bit of the weight off of AIV's shoulders. It's like, alright, I don't need to worry about three-stocking anymore. I just need to worry about playing the game and finishing strong for a team that has made a really impeccable run. Though Matt Beach is determined to take momentum all out of AIV's side at any and every point. <laughs> 
Oh, he tried to run up up tilt and uh, not working out. Yeah, and I mean, you know, yeah, if you're AIV, man, just play your game. You know, just try to win, try to win the set. And that was a great see. That was really good. Up throw, going, going to platform, reading the air dodge. Good stuff coming out from AIV. Oh, that up did not hit. That's so unfortunate. <laughs> that up beat completely went. So the fun thing about Mega Man's up tilt is that not only is it fast, it, and it is very minus, but the reason that stages like Battlefield and PS2 are so much better for Mega Man is because you only the actual landing lag isn't the problem. <laughs> oh, he did land on full stage. The upbeat just whiffed. I thought he landed on platform. Never mind. Forget what I was saying. That's just unfortunate. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Can we, can we run back to that last stock, producer? Okay. No. When when he when he upbeats? Okay. Pause it right here. No, wait, wait, wait. before that, before that, before that, before that. I I want to see the upswing, like how the upswing whiff. Yeah. Did he like squish? Or was he too hot? It might have been a Z axis, actually. Hey, okay, uppercut. Wow. Oh, he yeah, that's a Z axis. Oh, no, bro. He's. <laughs> <laughs> wait. Ooh. Wait, did he just. Wait, that, no, that's just a whiff. No, yeah, because the scoop is oh. only front facing. Oh, no. God, he just missed. That is, um, that's sad. That's, a, that's very unfortunate. And run up up till, yeah, that's unfortunate. Yeah. I'm running back, small battle. Smashville? Smashville, right? Small battle. Yeah, small battle. Understandable. Yeah, good stage. Good stage for just like a variety of characters. Yeah, I mean, it's Battlefield, but with no top platform. So if you like small, if you like side plats, you like this stage. and. Boy, just Ike like side plats. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's one of those things if you're trying to take this, if you're trying to take stocks fast. Yeah, you, it's all probably a good pick. Yeah, just less space to move, uh, more uh, more space just to start swinging. And Mega Man, Mega Man likes to move. He, albeit he doesn't have he doesn't have like any ridiculous movement tech. He just is constantly running back and forth, and jumping around, and trying to clip you with any of these pellets. That, that's the name of the game with Mega Man, and the more, the more that uh, the AIV struggles to struggles to find its way in, the better it will be for Matt Beach. Is that is kind of the perfect timing to close out the first stock for Matt Beach. Yeah, and, and even with AIV keeping their jump right, held on to that jump just in case, still wasn't enough for Ike to get back and um. Yeah, like like you said, good stuff by Matt Beach, good timing, and um, yeah, it's really not, still not that big of a deficit. Uh, it just seems like that Matt Beach has had a knack for keeping his stocks for pretty long. Yeah, his survivability has been uh, off the charts, though. These dash attacks are they're not the greatest. I mean, top spin isn't the best move in in Mega Man Three, let alone the best move in this game, though it it serves its function. As robots oh, yeah. tend to do. Yeah, no, it's it's definitely it's it's very similar to a Ouija dash attack in that sense, right? Yeah. Where it's a move that on hit provides a lot of value, sends you off the stage pretty well. It actually combos um, from things, right? But it's like on 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 block, it's really bad. <laughs> it's, yeah, it's pretty bad on block. But it's a definitely a, a moderate risk, moderate moderate reward type of thing. So. Yeah, you can use it to like catch spot dodge things of that nature. I mean, he's multi hits are good at that for a reason, though it doesn't have much benefit besides that. Particularly since Mega Man has so many other uh, burst range moves that kill, like a, uh, you know, charge shot. It's pretty solid, very safe. <laughs> he shot three charge shots in three seconds yep. and <laughs> just took his stock. And um, yeah, nice up tilt for AIB. You know, just anti-airing Matt Beach coming back down to the ground. So, let's see if AIV can get something started, man. Missing text like that is not the way to get things started. Particularly since a lot of the times, uh, AIV's been favoring just the neutral tech more than any tech rules. So, that's perfectly fine. I mean, Matt Beach will just run forward and uh, it'll be 
like running jab, running jab into Nair, which is all looks the same, but Nair actually has knockback. No, don't jump, please. <laughs> please don't jump. I'll do it. Oh yeah, and, and Mad Beach is definitely fishing for a uh, metal blade back air right now. Fishing really hard for it. AIV is not giving it to him. 112%, AIV is fighting for his life right now. Trying to fight back. And but Matt Beach is just playing so patient right now. There, see that was that was the thing I was trying to I was mentioning earlier before it didn't it lost relevance. Landing up till uh, going for up till you'll land on the PS2 or on the battlefield platforms, which uh, cuts down the amount of time that uh, up till is in lag for because you go immediately into landing lag instead of waiting to get back to the ground. You just land on the platform. Which makes it just a little bit safer, which can matter a ton. Seven, man, it's a huge deficit at this point, but it looks like Matt Beach is really trying to end it his way and not just any way. But nothing doing right. Oh, that shield oh, that poke. poke. Yeah, that shield poke, man. And um, yeah, man, double two stop by Matt Beach actually closing out, closing out this victory for DePaul in very strong fashion. Yeah, what a turnaround from the start. Like it was like Colorado wins game uh set one. It's a close one stock affair set two. And then Skull Kid, Bobby Time and Matt Beach wrap things up with uh one two stock a piece across all three of their sets and what's this what can you really say but like right, all of them really solid games like incredible like ggs across the board mm. but uh depaul yeah. shows why they're seed one 